play it off. It's Onye, and this is actually the second time that I'm recording this video because the first time I recorded it, the whole thing, and then I realized that I had something in my Jeep. So I had to redo it, and here we are. So this is a long overdue review of my privileged hair extensions. If you follow me on Instagram, I've actually posted a lot of photos of this hair. If you're not following me, take a little second right now, head on over to Instagram and follow Pieces of Onye. Um, I'm actually a lot more active on that platform than I am on this one, but I'm getting better. So yeah, as I mentioned, this is a review of Privileged Hair Extensions. It's about, I want to say 15 ounces, I kind of forgot, but it's a lot of hair and it's super long. I think it's 25 inches at the longest length. Y'all know I love my long hair. <laughs> I am also wearing a closure from Privileged Hair Extensions because my hair likes to act a plum full and it will not whatsoever blend with this hair. Even though this is like a lower luster, it's like that magic luster of like low and medium. But my hair, no. So I did have to get a closure and I really did the basics with it. I just plucked it open a bit and that's it. Like I really don't have the patience to do all this dyeing, sticking it in some tea, um, glue. I, I don't have the patience for it. It looks good in the end, but the girl can't do it all. So yeah, basic tweaking and just kind of like laying it down and using some magical unicorn wax to slick down the edges. I love, love, love the closure. I think it looks really natural um, and it blends really w well with this hair. I think one of the biggest issues that I had with Argeny is that I didn't have no closure to match it, so I have to leave my hair out and my hair suffered. So that's what I really love about this company. They actually offer closures to match the hair. Hey now. Really quickly before I lose this amazing light coming through the window. Side note, natural light is the business. Okay, look at it. Ah. Anyway, I wanted to touch briefly on um, the company itself. So talk a little bit about the brand for those who are wondering. Um, it's called Privileged Hair. And just like its name, it's all about making women feel beautiful, luxurious. And I think the hair kind of just speaks for itself. Like, I feel I'm every woman, it's all in me. Okay. I feel luxurious in this hair, you know? Not just because it's hanging down to my ankles and looking glorious, but it's just beautiful quality. And it, you, can, you can see it. Like, I can run my hands through this. You saw me curl it take this brush through it and the waves are still there where, where else you gonna get that okay but i digress um so yeah it was started by two young women and they sell 
virgin hair from South and Southeast Asia. And they have over 30 years of experience between them. They, they know the hair, they know the process, they own the process, so you know that you're getting quality hair. A lot of, time, a lot of times with other companies, like they buy it once it's already a, a final product, and so you don't know what happened to that hair along the way. And so to have a company that is transparent with their process, you know, owns it from start to finish, you can, you can kind of trust it. And like, so they offer three different collections, all of which have 100% virgin hair. There's Signature, Avant, and Adorn. The Signature and Avant collections, not touched, they're completely 100% unprocessed. And then the Adorn collection has undergone a two-day steam process. They don't do any hair coloring, any bleaching, or do anything to the hair that will potentially damage it. And all of the hair is Remy, which means that the cuticles all go in one direction, which means no tangling. Here are a few more fun facts on the company. They do offer financing and layaway. So if you don't have it like that right now, I understand things happen. You can actually finance it or put it on layaway. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do to look fly, okay? Nobody has to know. Um, they do also offer free shipping, no catch to it, no minimum, just free shipping. And what I thought was really cool is that they don't have like gift cards, they give you the option to gift, gift this. And so essentially you're able to pick out a blend and gift it to somebody. For example, if you wanted to gift me some new hair, you can gift it to Anya and I will happily accept. Um, they do also have a 360 virtual room feature where you can go onto the website and actually look at the hair from all angles okay because sometimes you gotta look at things up and down to the side and from behind to know if it's good so you do have that and I think this is what really helps like separate them from the crowd like you can tell they kind of go that extra mile to make sure you know that you're getting high quality hair extension I think they really stand behind their product trust me you could not go wrong with this Okay, I did um, pose a question on my Instagram and I posted a picture of this hair. Again, if you're not following, head on over. But I did ask if you guys had any questions for me to answer in this video and I did get a few, so I do wanna walk through those really quickly. So the first question I already answered, is that a closure you're wearing from them? If so, what is your experience with it? Again, yeah, it is a closure. Um, I think it is actually phenomenal. Again, I didn't go through all the, you know, the hoops and hurdles to get it looking like super perfect, but still it looks, I think, pretty good for not having to do much. Literally all I did was pluck this open just a little bit more and then pop it on my wig. It was good to go. The next question, does it tangle? Is it comparable to our Juni? How many ounces do you need for a full head? In terms of tangling, I don't have any issues, especially for hair this long. I have no issues. I did have a few issues when it was in its natural state, and I think that's more because it's so long and the natural pattern is like really, really wavy. And so naturally you're gonna get a little bit of um, slight tinkling, but nothing too major. When I straighten it and when I wear it like this, no issues whatsoever. None. <laughs> um, let's see, is it comparable to Arginine? Absolutely. Like, honestly, if someone gave it to me and said it was arginine, I'd have no questions. I'd, be, I'd believe them. Like, the luster is like that beautiful, medium-low luster, high quality, no shedding. Yes, it is very comparable to arginine. How many ounces do you need for a full install? Of course, that depends on how long you want it, how full you want it. I think just like I think it's the standard amount of ounces you would need. Eight ounces for a moderately full um, install, 10 ounces if you like that <laughs> body, and 12 plus ounces if you're like me and you like your hair ridiculously full. And that is it guys. Um, I just realized that I never showed pictures of the hair in its natural state. So I think um, this week I'm actually gonna just wash it, uh, let it air dry so you can see the natural pattern of it, and then I will Either post a picture on my Instagram feed or Instagram story. So be sure you're following me so you don't miss out. And again, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below and I'll get back to you. And also, don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribing. Alright, bye guys.